Voldemort was featured as a puppet in the opening ceremony of what city's 2012 Olympics? This is Trivia with Buds. What it be and welcome to another episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. Thanks for checking out the show. Today's episode all about he who shall not be named Voldemort. I just named him, so I'm in big, big trouble. And coincidentally, my kids are watching uh, episodes, excuse me, episodes, um, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows part one and part two. Two, tonight, back to back, my wife says. I was like, isn't that like six hours? She goes, no, I looked it up. It's just over four. And uh, we're going to try and watch them both. And I said, Godspeed. So they've been reading all the books and watching all the movies one by one. They've made it to the end. And uh, very coincidental for this Voldemort quiz today. We have a fun fact of the day at the end of the episode about the world's strongest man winner, John Paul Sig Marson. So listen for that. And your triple connections, we have Thanksgiving, Trivial Pursuit, and Jack Horner. Thanksgiving, Trivial Pursuit, and Jack Horner. What's the connection between those three things? Find out at the end. We're all warmed up and we're ready for Voldemort trivia. Here we go. All right. A batch of questions on he who shall not be quizzed. But we're quizzing them anyway. Number one, in the Harry Potter series, what are the masked and tattooed followers of Voldemort called? Number one, in the Harry Potter series, what are the masked and tattooed followers of Voldemort called? Number two, the final Horcrux destroyed was Voldemort's snake, Nagini. Who killed her? Number two, the final Horcrux destroyed was Voldemort's snake, Nagini. Who killed her? Number three, what is the family name of Voldemort's pure blood descendants whose story is completely absent from the Half Blood Prince film? Is it Gaunt, Slinkhard, or Rookwood? Gaunt, Slinkhard, or Rookwood? Number four, in the Deathly Hallows, who sends a Patronus, Patronus, Patronus or Patronus, to inform the Order of the Phoenix that Voldemort has taken over the Ministry of Magic? In Deathly Hallows, who sends a Patronus to inform the Order of the Phoenix that Voldemort has taken over the Ministry of Magic. Number five, in the books, who speaks Voldemort's name for the first time? In the books, who speaks Voldemort's name for the first time? Number six, Voldemort died in May of what year in the HP timeline? Voldemort died in May of what year? Number seven, where did Voldemort work after leaving Hogwarts? Number seven, where did Voldemort work after leaving Hogwarts? Number eight, in the book Goblet of Fire, what two words did Voldemort first say when returning? In the book Goblet of Fire, what two words did Voldemort first say when returning? Number nine, what color are Voldemort's eyes? What color are Voldemort's eyes? Number 10, who does Voldemort get expelled for having a pet when they were in school together? Who does Voldemort get expelled for having a pet when they were in school together? And number 11, Voldemort was featured as a puppet in the opening ceremony of what city's 2012 Olympics? Those are all your questions for Voldemort trivia. Harry Potter fans probably got them all correct. If you're the youngest person in your car and you got them all correct, you get to drive the rest of where you're going. Uh, tell your parents I said it's okay. We'll be right back with the answers after this. We are back with the answers to Voldemort trivia. Let's see if you got all 11 questions correct. Number one in the Harry Potter series, what are the masked and tattooed followers of Voldemort called? Death Eaters, Death Eaters. Number two, the final Horcrux destroyed was Voldemort's snake, Najini. Who killed her? That was Neville Longbottom, Neville Longbottom. Number three, what is the family name of Voldemort's pure blood descendants whose story is completely absent from the Half-Blood Prince film? That is Gaunt, G-A-U-N-T, Gaunt. Number four, in the Deathly Hallows, who sends a Patronus to inform the orders, uh, Order of the Phoenix that Voldemort has taken over the Ministry of Magic? That's Kingsley Shacklebolt. Kingsley Shacklebolt. Number five, in the books, who speaks Voldemort's name for the first time? Dumbledore. Dumbledore. Number six, Voldemort died in May of 1998 in the storyline, uh, timeline of the original books. Number seven, where did Voldemort work after leaving Hogwarts? Borgen and Burks. Borgen and Burks. 
Number eight in the book, Goblet of Fire, what two words did Voldemort say when returning? Robe me. Robe me, like get me a robe. Number nine, what color are Voldemort's eyes? Red. They are red. And number 10, who does Voldemort get expelled for having a pet when they are in school together? That is Hagrid, the groundskeeper. They went to school back at Hogwarts together. And number 11, Voldemort was featured as a puppet in the opening ceremony of what city's 2012 Olympics? That would be London. There you go. Closing out our quiz on he who shall not be named. Hope you got 11 out of 11. Your fact of the day for today, four-time World Strongest Man winner, John Paul Sigmarsson, who famously stated, there's no reason to be alive if you can't do a deadlift, died at age 32 while deadlifting in his gym. So that is little uh, macabre and ironic that that's what happened to that guy. Triple Connections, we had Thanksgiving, Trivial Pursuit, and Jack Horner, all things that have pie. You get a pumpkin pie or apple pie at Thanksgiving. Pie pieces in Trivial Pursuit, and little Jack Horner put his thumb in a pie. Thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend, and we'll see you next time for more trivia with Buds. Cheers.